Alex from NY Capture, and today I'm going to be doing a little unboxing video. Uh, I received the Flashpoint Explorer 300, uh, also known as the Godox 8300 Pro, and I'm going to open it up and take a look and see what's inside and talk a little bit about it. Uh, I also have the 8400 and the 8200, so I can talk a little bit about uh, the difference in size and whatnot. Um, but essentially, uh, I'm going to be doing a shoot with all three of them and testing them out and comparing them in the next couple of days. So uh, stay tuned and, and can see more about that. So let's get to opening up here. We have the manual in here. And then it comes in a nice case. Take a look inside the case and see what we got. Wow, that's a great size. Uh, this is going to be perfect to go into my bag. Uh, so it comes with uh, the battery charger. Uh, and here's one battery. And they are backwards compatible with the 8200, I believe. Um, but they are a different kind of battery. Uh, so we have the battery and the charger. And this is a plug for the charger. Uh, then it comes with, and this is, I believe, the same as it is for the 8200. Um, so that you can mount this. And then, uh, and here, here's the light. Wow, this is light. Um, so it comes with the light here. There's a digital screen uh, with all of the settings and everything. And then we have uh, the cover here. And uh, this is a, actually a smaller bulb. Um, and it's a bit different than it is on the 8400. Uh, so you need to use an adapter um, when you want to use a Bowens mount or different kinds of mounting. Um, but wow, this thing is really uh, it's really nice. I'm looking forward to, to getting out there and shooting with it. So I wanted to go ahead and compare the 300 uh, in size and shape and everything with the 200 and the 600. Uh, so if you take a look, here's the 300 on its own. And then here's the 200, 8200 Pro. This is the Godox version. Uh, Flashpoint is Adorama's brand, but it's the same manufacturer. Uh, so if you look at it, the 200 is a little bit taller, but it's a little more narrow. Um, they're, they're not uh, too dissimilar. Um, in weight. Uh, the 300 is a little bit heavier, um, but I also have the battery in it. I don't have the battery in on this one right now. Um, but they're not going to take up that much difference in room in your bag until you get to the 400. The 400 is much larger. Um, if you take a look at the size difference there, it weighs a lot more, um, especially, you know, it has this bracket on here. Uh, so it takes up a lot of room. I've tried to travel with it. Um, I brought it in my carry-on bag, uh, and it's heavy, and it's not really that convenient and not that easy to manage on your own. Uh, for the power that you get and for the price and everything else, it's a great, great light, and I'm going to continue to use it. Um, but I am very excited about the 300, if you see that, uh, and adding that to my bag. So that was our unboxing video of the Explorer 300. Um, I didn't go into a lot of details, a lot of specs. Um, I'll probably wait until I get out there and shoot with it uh, a bit more to, um, to go into that, but I just wanted to see kind of what it looked like and how it compared to the uh, 200 and the 400 in size and, and feel and the weight and everything and the shape. Uh, and I'm, I'm really excited to use it. I think for the size uh, and the form factor and then the power, the 300 watts that it gives you uh, and for the price, it's a really great value. Um, and uh, I'm excited to get out there. I plan to go out and shoot in the next couple days with it. Uh, and so I'll do a little behind the scenes video of that. And, uh, and then when I get the results back, I'll be sure and share that. Um, you can see some of my work at uh, my website at nycapture.com. 
and uh, you can check out some more stuff on Instagram. It's nycapture1. Um, and uh, I look forward to hearing from you. If you have any comments or any questions or anything, uh, please leave them here. Uh, and I hope you like the video and, and subscribe to my channel. I hope to have more th videos coming out, more unboxing and behind the scenes and tutorials and things like that. Uh, I may even do some interviews with people. So subscribe and ring the bell as well if you, if you click on the bell and you'll get notifications of, uh, of new material coming out. So I hope you're all well. Thank you. And uh, I'll see you next time.